Jeffree Star has finally made an appearance on social media more than 10 days after he and Shane Dawson were exposed by Tati Westbrook. But rather than address the drama, he released new makeup. Are we really that surprised? What's gravy fam? You are watching IO. I'm Charlotte. Like, subscribe, follow Hash Browns. So let's get into the news. Okay, so apart from living his best life in pools, Jeffrey has been avoiding all the drama on social media. I mean, I wouldn't say he's been avoiding it. I think he's being calculated. If you watched my last video on Jeffrey, you know that he posted a makeup tutorial with a black man who he claimed he was on a date with. Is it just a coincidence that Jeffrey is now dating a black man in the midst of being called a racist? No. It isn't a coincidence. And is it a coincidence that his former friend Tab David accused him of calling Black China stupid? And then Jeffrey reappears on social media in photos with none other than Black China. No. Jeffrey is being very calculated about his next moves, and here is your proof. Last night, he made an appearance on Jeffree Star Cosmetics on the Instagram page. He posted this photo promoting a new formula of his Velour Lip Liners. Now, apart from the comment section of this video, there isn't much else to talk about. The comment section is a mix of diehard Jeffree fans and people who... Uh, let me just show you the comments. Here were all the top comments from the photo at the time of this writing. I didn't alter anything. I hate this cancel culture, like if you agree. Heart eye kitty emojis. Heart eye emojis. Oh, give me that Gemini. And this next one is kind of interesting. Lipstick Nick commented, this campaign was so fun to do. That red outlined lip. So it's clear that Lipstick Nick is still supporting Jeffrey through all of this. Maybe she's doing this, you know, for business. Maybe she's also going to be in the campaign based on what she commented. So now is when the negativity starts. New racism collection coming autumn 2020. Oh yeah, I forgot to unfollow you here too. No thanks hun, not till you speak up. And no. <laughs> You get the idea. I mean, there's genuinely a lot more, but I'm not gonna, I, you guys can go and read them for yourselves. I'm gonna get a bit salty if I keep reading, so let's just focus on why Jeffrey's staying silent. Jeffrey is smart. There is a reason why he's the CEO of a very successful makeup company. He knows PR, he knows about business, he is likely working with a PR team behind the scenes on what to say and do next. Jeffrey knows that all eyes are on him right now. Everyone is waiting for him to post something or say something. So what does he do? He uses the publicity to announce a new product. Granted, if you know about the makeup world, you know that launches are planned months in advance. Like other launches, this launch was probably planned for a date and was maybe even pushed back by a few days, especially considering everything going on. But most business people know that putting out a press release is vital in times of controversy, especially when a brand is being targeted. Why do you think so many businesses spoke out during Black Lives Matter? Because there's money at stake and you have to appease consumers. So guys, I wanna hear from Jeff Jeffree Star fans specifically, do you think he should make a statement addressing everything? Or do you think it's better to stay silent? Let me know down in the comments. For now, I'm gonna quickly wrap this one up with some comment features from my video. Jeffree Star is completely unbothered. Amani said, I think he's just pretending everything is fine when it's not. So here's the tea. Honestly, there are likely millions of people who aren't aware of Jeffrey's indiscretions or the drama that's going on on YouTube. We YouTube junkies like to think the world revolves around YouTube, but the fact is there are so many people who don't even know what's going on. He is marketing to those people, in my opinion. Have you ever tried to explain to someone who's like not on YouTube what's going on with Jeffree Star, James Charles, and Tati, and Shane? It's like, what? I don't care. Like, they don't care. They don't give a Hannah Grabinski said, I just realized that Charlotte goes left, right, left, right, left, right. Yes, we do actually uh, have a new teleprompter at the studio. It's, it's much bigger than the old one. So my eye line shifts a lot more because there's more space to read. Uh, yeah, not much I can do about that, sorry. <laughs> Bookish Raider said, I'm completely done with the drama. At the same time, I never had a comment shout out. Well, allow me to oblige. Well done. All right, guys, that is it for me. Thanks for watching. Leave a like on this video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you want more. I'll see you guys next time. <laughs> I hear you laughing back there. Hey. <laughs> All right.